Hello everyone and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And coming right up, we have live action from the Saudi Pro League. How's it going to go, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And they kick off here. Now can they make something happen? And tipping it over the crossbar. Well, no escape. Not an immediate yellow card, but the referee deals with him now. And over it comes, and still dangerous. Well, possibilities in the centre, and a no-nonsense clearance. And great use of the ball to keep possession. Must take the lead here. Oh, but he's missed it! How on earth is this still level? Well, I just don't know, Derek. Just a real lack of composure in the end. They should be ahead now. Hilal Sudani. Fluency of movement. Could be threatening. And just over the bar, really good effort. Santini. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Felipe Augusto. And a goal kick is the outcome.
Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Santini. Promising possession, this. Chance to cross. And the danger is still there. Right over for now, it seems. And can they make one of these passes count? And the snuffing out of the cross there. And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick. Who's going to get on the end of it? It didn't happen for them. Couldn't hang on to it. Felipe Augusto. And attempting the through ball. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Tremendous ball played through. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Well, the stats don't lie. It's been very tense and an even battle so far, but neither side has played with enough quality to pose a real threat going forward, and that needs to change. And options in the centre. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Osawi. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Osawi. And so it is, the first half story has been written. to the second half then and these two sides are locked together just can't really choose between them at the moment Zelaya well it's one pass after another the high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle and teammates to play it to. Osawi. And he knows he must thump it away. And couldn't keep himself onside. Couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw-in to come. Hilal Sudani. Osawi. Still passing it around with authority. Spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. And a strong tackle. And now, passing it through. He's managed to get in behind. 
Well, it's a good deflection. That'll be a corner. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Who can they pick out? Well, time just challenged magnificently. Bickheim. And cuts inside. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Moving it forward. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. No way through. What a decisive punch by the keeper. Hilal Sudani. Chance to play it in. You can sense the threat is there. Real chance. Missing the target by a tiny margin. Well, it's a difficult skill to get right, but he almost pulled it off there. He made such good contact with the ball. And the substitution will occur now. Just couldn't keep the ball. Can they push ahead on the closing stages? And it crossed the byline. A goal kick as a result. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Sadan. An incisive pass. Well, not allowed to continue. He had drifted into the offside position. Well, if he takes a step back to the ball and then spins in behind, he'll be onside. But he does know where the space is. Well, they've decided to make a change. Al Nahli. And just five minutes remaining. Succeeded in keeping it in play. Level pegging, but can they change that? He cuts it back. A top save, and that keeps it all square. Well, you're right, Derek. A top class save, and such an important one as well. That surely would have been it had it gone in. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Played over. Surely! Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here.
Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. One nil then. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Well, fantastic reflex action. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Yes, Derek, there was very little in it for much of the game. I'm sure they feel they deserved a point at least. And it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on. But they just have to bounce back now. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's made his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, he was the best player on the pitch today. His movement, skill and work rate were excellent. And of course, what a time to come up with a goal.